Hey guys, stay patient here with another trophy and achievement guide for Overwatch. This one's going to be looking at group health plan, which requires you to restore 200 health for five players without dying as Mercy in quick or competitive play, of course. Now, Mercy is one of these support class characters. She's a very good medic to use, nice and easy to pick up. And you're going to be using her Caduceus staff here, if that's how you pronounce it. I'm not 100% sure. But if you hold R2, it's going to lock on to one of your teammates that's close by. And the great thing is that you can carry on moving around freely and the lock on stays intact as long as you are within range of them. So you don't need to necessarily be keeping on looking at the person that you're healing. You can sort of run around them. You can look in the opposite direction to make sure you're staying safe. And in fact, that is one of the best bits of advice I can give you, that staying safe is very important for this. When it says you need to do it without dying, it doesn't matter if your teammates die, but if you die, it resets everything. And because you need to get 200 health healed on five characters, that means everybody on your team needs to have experienced a lot of healing from you, basically. So you need to be able to stay alive long enough to heal all of your team members for 200 health each. So staying alive is the key thing here. You want to stay in cover. You want to try and find one of the choke points where your team is trying to make it through a small entrance or something. And you're going to stay there in cover away from the enemies and just keep healing those characters. Now, if you do well at this, if you're a good healer, a good medic, then your team are going to come to you. They're going to know that if they back away from the fight, if they're low on health, that they are going to be healed up by you. So you won't necessarily need to put yourself in dangerous positions to get those heals. If you're playing well, then people will come to you and you need to just make sure to keep healing those with the lowest amount of health so that they stay alive and so that they feel confident in coming to you when they do need healing. Now, the best way to know who is low on health is of course to look out for those critical markers. If someone is very low, it will show up on screen that they are critical and you'll know to heal them nice and quickly. The rest of the players will either be green or orange and you can even see them through walls as mercy so if you look out for those orange characters those are the ones who have taken some damage and do need some healing so keep an eye out for the different colors make sure you're focusing on the guys that do need healing and this trophy will come quite easily and naturally now mercy does have a sort of hidden passive ability that heals her while you're healing your teammates so that's another way that you can easily stay alive as long as you're playing it safe she does have quite a low amount of health, so if you get hit for a lot of damage quickly, then you are going to die quite easily. But as long as you're only taking small amounts of damage here and there, then obviously while you're healing your teammates, you're going to boost your own health up, and it's going to be easy to survive for long enough to get this trophy. So as always guys, thank you very much for watching. This trophy is a very simple one that you'll earn without my help probably. It didn't necessarily need a guide, but I'm trying to cover as many of the trophies as I can for posterity. So keep your eye on the channel. I'm going to be covering as many of the trophies as possible. So I really appreciate all the support. Like the video if you found it helpful. Subscribe for more gaming content and I'll catch you all next time.